Welcome to Cedar Point, my name is Jay Flores. I'm the Global STEM Ambassador at Rock Automation and the host of the series, It's Not Magic, It's Science. I'm here with the whole park to myself to show you guys the sneak peek to find out how science makes all the magic happen here at Cedar Point. Stay tuned for our five part video series where we're going to show you that it's not magic, it's science that makes your favorite rides possible. My name is Jay Flores and this isn't magic, it's science. Welcome back to It's Not Magic, It's Science, where in our last video we showed you that we had three glasses full of water along with our little Lucy, placed her on this platform and spun them around several times without them falling out or Lucy getting wet. So how did we do it? Remember, it's not magic, it's science. In this case, Newton's first law is our friend and it states that any object in motion tends to stay in motion unless if acted upon by a greater force. And so by spinning the water and Lucy in a circular motion, that water wants to stay along that motion. And yes, there's gravity acting upon it, but we're accelerating this object at a great enough force that it keeps in place. And so Lucy stays dry, I stay dry, and we all learn a little bit more. So make sure to stay tuned to It's Not Magic, It's Science. Welcome back to It's Not Magic, It's Science. In the first couple videos, we showed you the science behind the magic of the flipping cups and Lucy. We showed you how we didn't get wet and how that science makes it all possible. Today's our exploration video, where we're gonna show you how Newton's Law actually feels like. So you can explore what some of those forces feel like on a loop coaster and feel that force going all the way around. You can try this experiment at home with a couple pieces of cardboard or styrofoam and some string, or you can come visit us and feel some of those forces for yourself on any loop coaster. And remember, it's not magic, it's science. 